My friends, something important is happening. All of us have a chance to be involved in history. Saturday, June 11th, 2011, in St. Moritz, Switzerland. My reporters, Aaron Dykes and Paul Watson, have traveled there to cover Bilderberg 2011. If you don't know who the Bilderberg Group is, many of their documents have been leaked. This is the group that covertly set up the European Union, uh, that are pushing the global carbon tax, that are promoting the attacks on free press. They are authoritarians. It's a collection of the heads of the major mega banks, British and Dutch royalty, the Rockefellers, the Rothschilds, Henry Kissinger, they're all there. But in past years, our moles inside have gotten us their agenda. And we've been able to predict a year before that gas prices would explode, that the housing market would be destroyed, that Obama would be the presidential nominee and that Hillary would stand down. There has been a corporate media blackout on this information in the United States. Europe is beginning to cover it. The Bilderberg Group is hiding out in the beautiful uh, mountain area of St. Mort's, hoping that the uh, spotlight of public scrutiny stays away from them. They're like cockroaches that sneak out when the lights are off at night. I am calling for a protest by people in Europe, particularly Switzerland, to converge on St. Moritz. There's already alternative media there. There's already a lot of protesters, a few hundred. But we need to see tens of thousands there. Not protesting the capitals in Spain and France and Germany and Greece and other areas where the puppets, the bought and paid for politicians, uh, serve Bilderberg Group, not the front men, but actually going and protesting the true leadership of this planet, people that have taken control of our world through fraud and corruption. They don't have total control yet, but they're trying to get it right now. They're engineering financial collapses. The internal information we've gotten and we're covering at Infowars.com is nothing short of incredible. You have a chance to be part of history. Imagine if you converge, if you live in Europe or you live in Switzerland, if you live in Italy or France or other countries that border Switzerland and you travel to St. Moritz, you've got three days to get there. High noon on that Saturday at the hotel, all the details are listed about the protest and my call for it at Infowars.com and PrisonPlanet.com and below me here on this YouTube channel. What will your protest do? It will force international media to cover the fact that the world's elite, the heads of the mega banks that are imploding our economies by design, bringing in austerity, just like they've done as economic hitmen against third world countries, and it will shine the light upon them. That's why Zbigniew Brzezinski addressing the CFR of Canada last year warned the elite that for the first time in history, mankind is politically awakened. That's a total new reality, total new reality. It has not been so for most of human history. The globalists wish to hide out of the searing lights of publicity in a remote village of St. Moritz in Switzerland. The date is 6-11-11, Saturday, June 11th. The time is high noon. Please respond to this call against tyranny. These are the people that are steering and controlling our world through fraud. These are the individuals. We've discovered their agenda many times from our moles that are trying to convert our world into a high-tech tyranny. And they are hiding out everywhere they go. They put pressure on the media of the country they're in to not cover what they're doing. They have the police and military and surveillance grids paid for by taxpayers protecting them from the eye of scrutiny because what they're doing is wrong. They're doing it under the cover of darkness and you can shed light, all of us, by spreading the word about this protest if you can't be there and if you can by actually arriving there will have a huge effect because we're not just going to be protesting their puppets, their politicians that they have groomed and financed and put into power. We're going to be going directly to the power brokers. And from multiple sources inside Bilderberg and from sources this year through Jim Tucker, who has proven that his information is 100% accurate, 
that he's getting from these sources, they are upset by the fact that media is starting to cover them. They are tearing their hair out that more and more protesters are massing no matter where they go. They do not want to be looked at. These are secret meetings. Jim Tucker's covered Bilderberg for more than 35 years. It took him 25 plus years to even get Western media to admit it exists. Three years ago, when the film New World Order came out, the New York Times wrote a piece saying that I was a crazy person in Virginia imagining elites and men behind trees. That's how dumb they think their readers are. They are still trying to prop up this hoax that we do not have these global elitist meeting in secret. People need to travel to Switzerland and confront the authors of this corruption and tyranny at point blank range peacefully. Ladies and gentlemen, they don't mind cracking people's heads if it's in Madrid or, or if it's in uh, Athens because that sends the message that you're little people, we're going to do whatever we want, we're going to attack peaceful folks. They do not want to draw attention by attacking protesters at Bilderberg. They are horrified of what is happening. There is over 1.5 quadrillion. That's 1,500 trillion in counterfeit fake financial instruments created by the six mega banks. All of their heads are meeting at this event and past Bilderberg event meetings. They've bought off our politicians. They've told them to sign us on to their debt as they raise our water prices, our fuel prices, as they engage in this tyranny to pay them everything to prop up the Ponzi scheme they've created. Take action. Even if you can't be there, spread the word about this protest and let's stand together in solidarity against the tyranny. We are unstoppable. We are invincible if you simply turn loose the dynamic power of the human spirit that refuses to submit. Ask yourselves, what are you doing in this time of great challenge? What are you doing to unlock minds? Go to Infowars.com and PrisonPlanet.tv for the latest headlines and cutting-edge information.